एसिटल एंड कीटल फॉर्मेशन इज रिवर्सिबल फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ वी हैव दिस अल्डी हाइट दिस रियक्ट विथ अल्कोहल इन एसिडिक मीडियम to form acetal now this reaction is reversible similarly we can have a ketone this can react with alcohol in acidic medium to form ketal this reaction is also reversible basically reversibility of acetal and ketal can be used for protection of carbonyl group for example let us consider the following conversion so we have to convert this molecule to this molecule what is the reagent that is required for this conversion so what reagent is required for the ave of conversion if you see this reaction we have a reduction of double bond so this reaction is a reduction of double bond this is carbon carbon double bond so we can use catalytic hydrogenation that is hydrogen in the presence of nickel but the problem is if i use catalytic hydrogenation carbon carbon double bond as well as carbon oxygen double bond both will be reduced so we will not get the desired product so in this case carbon carbon double bond as well as carbon oxygen double bond both gets reduced so we will use ketal formation so let us first react this compound with ethylene glycol in acidic medium and we will have acetal basically ketal 
and then we can do catalytic hydrogenation so this time we will only reduce the double bond and finally we can do hydrolysis hydrolysis of ketal will finally give ketone so we get the desired product So first ketone gets protected and then we have catalytic hydrogenation and then we have hydrolysis of ketal that gives ketone. Now let us do this conversion. So basically we have to replace chlorine with NH2 group. What is the reagent that will be used in this reaction? So if I react this molecule with ammonia, we can replace chlorine with NH2 group. But the problem is this C double bond O will also react and finally we will have this product. So in this case we are not getting the desired product. So we will use acetal formation. So we have this molecule first let us treat with ethylene glycol in acidic medium. we will have acetal. Now ammonia can act as a nucleophile we will have this product and finally we can do hydrolysis. So we will have this product that is the desired product. So you can see reversibility of acetal formation can be used as a protecting group. So first aldehyde and ketone can be converted into acetal or ketal and then we can do the desired reaction and finally acetal and ketal can be hydrolyzed to give aldehyde and ketone.